Hello there guys, welcome to Luna's World, Wayne here and first of all apologies for the microphone. I broke my lapel mic and uh, the new one hasn't arrived yet so this thing it might be a little bit poppy. So apologies. Um, this video is all about basically the video that I released yesterday and some of the discussions, some of the things that came about from that video. Now um, I got a lot of great comments and I got some trolls usual kind of stuff. The The main concern was the, the, the chunk in the middle um, and the fact that there seems to be this constant sort of battle between the two platforms in particular. So X-Plane 11 and prepared um, version 4, version 3, whatever, prepared users and kind of FSX users lumped in with the same group. Um, and uh, I just... I, <sighs> It baffles me because it's such a waste of energy. It's such a negative vibe. And um, that doesn't reflect what I think the community really is. Um, I've met some great people in the streams and through the videos and attending live events and things. And I just think the online presence of our community is just not very well represented. Um, and I don't know. I don't know why that is. Maybe you guys can help me out. Um, I think we need to try and make a concerted effort to just be more positive to each other, regardless of what um, sim you use. Because um, I think what's happening is people who are new to flight simming are coming in, and they're seeing these battles between the two sims, and they feel like they have to take sides, and. Or they just walk away, you know. So either scenario is not very good because it means that they might not choose the right simulator for what they really want to use it for based on a comment that they've read that says, you know, X-Plane is rubbish because or prepared is rubbish because or, you know. And so this came about from the video yesterday. Like I said, a lot of the comments were very well informed, uh, intelligent, well written, and then I got some trolls, that's normal. Um, but the main bulk was just this battle between the two things. And I just think it's not a good use of the time. I think it's, uh, you know, nothing ever good, nothing good ever comes from uh, negativity. And I think we owe it to our community to try and be positive to each other so that people coming in, people seeing our community from the outside think, actually, yeah, I want to be a part of that. That looks really cool. Cool bunch of people, great software. And also the special connection between us, the consumers of the software and the developers, because we we need them and they need us, you know. So again, if we get rid of that negativity, suddenly we have a really nice conversation with developers, you know, instead of seeing them as enemies, they're our friends. They'll start seeing us in the same way and they'll start listening to us even more and they'll start giving us what we really want, um, you know. And that's that's what we really want is a whole other video. So I'm not going to go into that. But uh, do, do you see what I get, I'm get? i getting at? I don't have the answers. I don't know how we can make this uh, better, but... I just think maybe by starting the conversation, getting out there, it might get the ball, the ball rolling. I don't know. Um, but I just think I, I would love to see more positivity in general. And I would love to see this battle between the platforms just kind of end. And I realize that people have invested money in a platform, which means that they can't necessarily afford to go over to another platform. I get that. Um you know, and I get the fact that you don't, people who invested a lot of money, they, they're sticking up for that as well. So I get, I get all that, but can we just be nicer? Can we just be calm? Can we, can we think about the comments that we write? And I'm not talking about on my channel, you can write whatever you like on my channel, no problems at all. But I just mean in general, overall, can we try and get rid of this divide, this massive crack between, uh, X plane or user X and user Y, you know, and the different platforms because we're all in it for the passion of flying and simulation. And that's what we need to focus on. And um, only good things can come of that, I'm sure. So anyway, guys, I hope you found this interesting. Please let me know your thoughts. Again, just think about your comments. This is not, I don't want to fuel any more arguments. I don't want to kind of make the divide bigger. Quite the opposite. I want us to try and patch it up 
and um, you know just accept that some people prefer a particular sim and that's fine you don't have to jump down their throats or you don't have to start a fight with them uh, because of that and you don't have to defend your choices either you know um, so there we go maybe food for four and uh, I hope I hope that's maybe got the ball rolling to try and patch uh, some of this up. But thanks all, as always, guys. I appreciate you listening and uh, look forward to hearing your comments. See you very soon. Take care.